taxes that they deserve. The Honourable Member for Outhamon. Stop blaming the Conservatives and start respecting here, here, his own promises. Here, 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 here. According to the Liberals, the problem is that it is impossible to decriminalize marijuana because it would be then sold illegally. I have some news for them. That's happening already. The only thing that would change is that tens of thousands of young Canadians would no longer have criminal records. And you know what, Mr. Speaker? That is a good thing. What does the Prime Minister not get about this? Why does he continue to ensure that young Canadians are being stuck with criminal records? The Right Honourable Prime Minister. Mr. Speaker, the NDP members have shown that they do not understand the issue of marijuana because decriminalizing it would give a legal stream of revenue to street gangs, to organized crime criminal groups and to arms traffickers. We have put forward a proposal to legalize marijuana in order to protect uh, our young people by making it more difficult for them to get access to marijuana and to eliminate uh, streams of revenue for criminal organizations. That's what we promised to do and that's what we're going to do. The Honourable Member for Utamon. Yes, sir, it's a classic case of do as I say, not as I do. The government's trying to argue that if we decriminalize marijuana, there may be some who will sell it illegally. This just in, that's what's happening now, Mr. Yeah, Speaker. Exactly. Do Liberals really think that they can tell everybody in Canada to stop smoking dope until they finally get around to legalizing it? That just doesn't make any sense. If the Prime Minister is serious about moving toward legalization, why is his government continuing to hand out tens of thousands of criminal records to young Canadians. That's wrong, and they can change it easily. Yeah. The Prime Minister. Legalizing marijuana is done with two things in mind. It's done to protect young people from having the easy access that they have right now uh, to marijuana, and it's about reducing the capacity of criminal organizations, street gangs, and gun runners uh, to make incredible profits off of uh, that marijuana. Until we bring in a legalized, controlled regime, marijuana remains illegal. Uh, that is the law of the land. That is what we are working on changing, but we will change it to protect our young people and protect our communities. Honourable Member for Lac Saint-Jean. 